is Masonic. Hi, and welcome to the Bitwig booth. I'm here at NAM 2025. My name is Frederick. I'm going to show you Bitwig Connect, which is our new hardware product that we announced just a couple of days ago. So here it is. Here is Bitwig Connect 412. It is a class compliant USB 2 audio interface, but it's also more than an audio interface. And I'll get to that in a second. So maybe we just start with the ins and outs. Let's look at the back side first. So these are your, shall we say, standard audio ins and outs. You have one combination mic line instrument input, one, well, line or instrument input, six balanced audio outputs, a dedicated headphone out, MIDI in and out, adapters included, a USB-C connector using the USB 2 protocol, for backwards and forwards compatibility. Moving forward to the top side of things, we have four analog outputs and two analog inputs, and they can be audio as well as CV gate. So these are DC coupled outputs as well as inputs, meaning that I can send CV and gate signals into my analog hardware and back again to either you know, control things in the analog world or using the analog world to control things in my DAW, Bitwig Studio, in this example. We have door controls, such as this transport control section for stop and start and rec um, and all of these things. We also have some monitor control features, so you can, you know, try out if your mix works in mono. You can dim the main out and you can swap to an alternative output if you have, say, a second pair of studio monitors like, I don't know, near-field monitors, and then you can uh, configure that however you wish. And then there's, of course, special Bitwig features. So starting with the scroll mode, I can navigate my timeline very nicely. I can zoom in out and scroll using this beautiful high resolution, high quality dial. And then of course we have the Bitwig mode. So the Bitwig mode, can, you can see it as like a one knob MIDI controller in a sense. And any parameter that I hover over, I can control using this very nice, high quality, smooth uh, 360 degree encoder. And very quickly kind of dial in whatever setting I feel is right, or of course to write automation and things like that. I can also lock a parameter by hitting the uh, Bitwig button again, and now this specific parameter is now locked and I can use my mouse to do other things. So being the software and the hardware manufacturer, there are additional ways we can integrate the two products with each other. So I've just created an audio track in my project and I've selected my input one and two from Bitwig Connect. And since we know what hardware it is, we can get access to like things like hardware gain, for instance, or direct monitoring directly inside the Bitwig Studio session instead of having like an, uh, an additional control panel app where these settings are. You can have a control panel as well, but we figured it's very nice and handy to have it straight in your project. And these settings can be saved with your project as well. Um, there are other things like, for instance, the analog outs and ins on the top to control modular. Since we know what kind of um, uh, components we have here, we can already factory calibrate the outputs to work perfectly with one volt per octave outputs, for instance. So you don't need to tune your, um, you know, your hardware devices. Yeah, so that's the quick rundown of Bitwig Connect 412. We um, hope to be able to take pre-orders in the next couple of weeks. It should be out and about spring 2025. The retail price is 499 euros or 549 US dollars. And uh, if you want to learn more, go to bitwig.com. Of course, there's all the info you need there. Thank you for watching.